Our age management program at the Aspen Institute for Anti-Aging and Regenerative Medicine is really the cornerstone of our Living Younger program where we do a very comprehensive uh, three to four hour evaluation and complete physical wellness evaluation with our wellness coordinator and my team as well as design a protocol based on laboratory data following evidence-based medicine protocols for uh, hormone replacement therapy, which can include uh, for men, testosterone, estrogen blockers, growth hormone, and for women, of course, estrogen, progesterone, testosterone, growth hormone, everything that we see start declining as early as age 30. And we also do a uh, wellness and fitness evaluation, calculating maximum oxygen uptake, uh, VO2 max, uh, we do that with a uh, exercise physiologist and specialist uh, in our area and use that data then to um, look at where we stand, kind of a snapshot of where we are now and then our goal is that every year that uh, does not decline or in fact improves as we set uh, levels and expectations together for your uh, optimal living program through our, our Living Younger program. We also provide you with a very extensive manual that we go through on a monthly basis with our visits, either uh, in person or via Skype or phone conference to help uh, make sure that each patient reaches their individual goals and that the program is then designed around them and their active and busy lifestyle. We do a laboratory data evaluation every three months. It's extremely important to make sure we're in the optimal ranges uh, for hormone replacement, not too high and again, not too low because we really wouldn't see the benefits uh, that we like and that the patient would like uh, without knowing those numbers. And so we avoid any risk and complications by staying on top of that, checking every three months and making sure that we're adjusting medications, lifestyle, diet, to see that all those goals uh, are reached. And so that really is our comprehensive uh, age management program, executive health evaluation. And uh, we then do that again on an annual basis, looking at those same parameters and markers of inflammation um, and cardiorespiratory function so that we can uh, always be on top of um, really reaching a level that maybe we haven't reached before personally and then to prevent disease and lower risk of disease and so it really is the cornerstone of what we do in our program.